Hello, good morning everyone. Good afternoon or good evening to wherever you are or we're watching right now. So, we're here again. It's me, Catherine, and this is my son, Caddy. Caddy, say hello. So, right now, we're going to <clears throat> review some um, winter coats or I will share also some tips how to um, choose your code depends on the weather that we have right here in Canada. Okay, right now we're here in Ontario. So the weather here is not that very cold, but it's still, sometimes it's still negative, okay? So we're going to put Kadi into her seat, into his seat, then we're going to share to you some tips. Okay. Hey! Okay, okay, sit down, baby. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Look at daddy's picture. Look at daddy's picture. So here guys, uh, I have some example here of winter coats and which I recommend. So this one, this coat that I have here, okay, this is a long coat which is a three, un, until to my, it's a three quarter. <coughs> the leg is three quarter to me. See, it's a military color with, oh, raccoon fur okay so this is made by makaj there's a tag here inside it's makaj okay so <clears throat> okay i know makaj is quite expensive type of coat but for my experience it's very nice because wearing this kind of coat wearing this type of coat as you can see, it's it looks very warm, right? Yeah, it is very warm. And it's in wearing this, you don't need to put on layering of your clothes. So, just a shirt or your dress. I usually wear a dress. So, just wearing my dress and then put on this type of coat. And then, I'm okay to go out. Because it's really hot. Okay? Especially if the weather is negative. Like until I wore this <clears throat> until it's negative 50, negative 20, like that. So, the good thing of this is there's like a vest inside that you can zip it up, and then you're good to go if you don't like to zip up everything. But you can zip it up all the way too. If it's too cold, you can zip it up all the way, and then there is a very big hood that you can cover your body <clears throat> so that the cold will not go onto you. Okay? You will not feel the cold. So there's also a rabbit fur here. So um, yeah. For all the coat that I have, this is my favorite. I love this coat. Uh, this coat it's been a year to me. So <clears throat> yeah. This is my latest because I guess with all the coat that I have, this is the most expensive one. <coughs> yeah, so I recommend this to everyone who want to buy a coat that is warm for the winter. Okay, then the next coat that I want to share to you is this. <coughs> this one is made of musnako, which is... It's the legit musnako. So this one have a fur too. This hood is detachable. And there's like a bling bling. Not, not bling bling. Okay. So this one, it's a very hot material also. It's a very good material. And the, the fur is very thick. I mean very thick. There's like, it's made of down. So this is a good 
coat also in which if you wear this you you still you're okay for negative 15 without any like other shirt inside so what I did is I wear this with my dress and then I'll just use this coat then I'm good to go okay so almost same thing with the makaj just the makaj is longer so this is called sterling parka this is made by mush knuckle and which there's a coat uh, there's a tag here anyway guys <clears throat> for those people who's trying to to acquire a good coat for a second hand so this one i'm selling it right now okay because I have that coat and I'm already bigger now than before so the size of this is XL oh, no XL extra small this is extra small this is original and which I bought from a store uh, from a mall here in Canada so these are originals okay <clears throat> so if you want to acquire this for a lesser amount in which if you buy this from the store uh, I bought this one for $960 that's three years ago three years or two years ago so if you want to acquire something that is good for second hand and a lower price you can give me a call thanks guys and <coughs> one thing more is is the same brand it's made of moose knuckle too but this is hot this is uh the bomber is hotter than the for my experience the bomber is hotter than the sterling the sterling parka so this is called a bomber okay it's a very warm material it's a very warm coat that you can wear if you want okay Uh, next is <coughs> um, this is already this is my coat which is called I think this is Tundra Tundra I'm not really sure this is made by Kanato Goose which is <coughs> this been my partner since 2013 okay so it's been with me for for a long time. I love this coat. This is a very warm coat. If you are <clears throat> planning to buy a coat that's made by Canada Goose, I recommend this. This is such a very nice coat that it's very warm. I think this good is do this type of coat is it's good until it's negative twenty five negative 25 so this size is <coughs> small so the only thing is I want to differentiate about the sizes the <coughs> the mokaj and um, mush knuckle their sizes is if it's extra small it's really extra small size okay so in which in Canada goose it's there's a bit it's a bit loose. Okay, there is a small loose. I think it's like half an inch loose um, bigger than the <coughs> than the other brand. So this is a very good product that they have the from Canada goose. So if you're a lady, don't get scared that you're not gonna you're not gonna see your cuteness I mean the size of your ways if you're sexy because this one there's a part here at the back that you can cinch inside so there's a string inside that you can pull if you want to emphasize your ways then you can pull the string okay so guys if you're planning to have a Canada Goose, this type of Canada Goose jacket is the best one because there's also um, 
nice big pocket around uh, in front that you can put your hands if you're cold like that and there's a good um cuff this i think it's cuff that you if you put your, your hands inside you can pull if you're cold and you can wear even though you don't have a uh, gloves right so it's good for negative 25 it's I'm saying based on my experience guys okay that has been my partner since 2013 okay so some of the codes that I will tell if I will show you right now is um, th these are thinner coats and with this one is a pregnancy coat so during my pregnancy uh, it's been uh, it's during winter so I need to get a pregnancy coat so this is a very <clears throat> it's made by modern eternity this one you can buy this at time maternity and which is it's quite cheap it's more than hundred dollars only and it's good for pregnant woman okay so I'm telling you guys if you buy this type of product this is a big size okay it's not the really warm but it's okay because guys if we are pregnant we feel hot so <clears throat> still a good thing right at least we have something to wear okay so the rest of the coat here that I'm going to show you is it's for car coat okay so I have here I have here a leather coat in which I wear I wore this if the weather is not the super cold okay it's it's during positive positive weather positive temperature like positive five I can still wear this okay especially if you're driving you can wear um, leather coat okay this is my this is made by denier it's denier coat okay so uh, that is a leather so if you want also a short one you can use it so this is made by leather too i'm um, by danier too it's a leather so you can use it as a car coat so sometimes i wore that since if the month is already october because october is quite windy so i wore that <coughs> so it's good it's some examples it's some uh, information for those people who are planning to come here in canada so which coat i need to bring if you're coming here in canada it depends upon the month that you will come okay so i wore also this one during spring the spring is so this one this is a car coat also that i wore if the weather is like positive 10 or until positive 5 it's a car coat so it's made of wool and it's it's made by guess so this this coat is a uh, made of wool and with a leather accent it's made by Bell Badsley Miss Mitska okay uh, this is the best uh, car coat that I want that I love so I wear that most of the time because it's the way they made it is quite fancy for me so that's why I love to wear yes baby who messaged us is it daddy let's check <clears throat> okay so that was that is good for the light weather and this one i wore also on like the weather during september or no september no um october it's a very light Sep 
uh, October to first week of November, you can still wear this. And what else? During end of March to April, so you can wear those kind of coat. So this one is also a car coat in which is made of wool. But it's a like a checkered thing that you can wear also from like October if it's not very cold. So you can still wear this type of coat. And this one is a vest. Okay, so you can wear vest. It depends upon you. Maybe you can wear this during October also or November. Then on the spring. You can wear it during like April. I wear vest on April. So it but it depends upon I usually wear vest with a long sleeve. So I put on a long sleeve and then the vest as long as the best thing that you need to protect is your body. Okay, the hands is okay. <clears throat> okay. So one thing more guys, so this one is just a cover up. That if the weather is it's a bit breezy, it's a bit cold like that. So I usually wear this type of cover up when we stay in in a air conditioned place like that. So the late um maybe late spring you can wear already this type of clothes. Okay. <clears throat> And one thing more guys, there are times that it's quite rainy here in Canada, so I have this raincoat. It's made uh, made by Hunter. <clears throat> so, this is a very cheap coat that you can buy. That it's, it's nice also if you put on, it's almost see-through, so you can... You can still flaunt whatever clothes that you have inside, okay? So it's a very nice material. So there's a um, string here that you can pull so that this one will cover you tightly. So it's good for rainy days. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Maybe I, I can help you for showing you this thing. Especially for those people who are planning to come to Canada. <clears throat> You're looking for a clothes that you will wear. It depends upon the weather here. Okay. So to wrap up this. Thank you so much for watching. So uh, please like and share our videos. And subscribe to, to our YouTube channel. And with my our channel is Cody Life's Journey. Thank you so much. Bye. We love you all.